follow this tutorial, you need to have Quartet, Mac OS 10.6.8 or greater, and Pro Tools 10. Open Pro Tools and create a new session. Click on Setup, Playback Engine. Set the buffer to 64. For lower latency, you can set it to 32, but you may need to adjust the buffer higher depending on the size of the project you're working on. Choose Quartet. You will see the following message asking if you would like to proceed. Choose Yes. Click OK in the I.O. window. Open the I.O. setup by clicking on Setup, I.O. Check Input and Output and make sure they appear as they do here. If they appear in any other way, you'll want to click on Delete Path and then Default. Make sure to do the same for both input and output. Open Maestro 2 found in the Applications folder and click on the Input tab. Here you can select from the different quartet input choices. Plus 4 and minus 10 bypass quartet's mic preamps and give you a direct line level connection to the ADD converter. Mic is for connecting a dynamic, ribbon, or condenser mic to quartet. If you're connecting a condenser mic, you'll also click on the 48 button to turn phantom power on. Instrument is for connecting a guitar, bass, or keyboard to the quarter inch instrument input. Now click on Output Routing. In the Output Routing section, you can select how you want to route Quartet's 8 output. The headphones default to outputs 1 and 2. If you would like to assign the headphones to any of the other outputs, simply select here. This is useful when sending a different mix to the performer. After connecting your headphones or monitors to Quartet, create a new track by selecting Track, New. Choose the input and output you wish to use in the Pro Tools Mixer window. Click on the Record Enable button. Adjust your input level with Quartet or in Maestro. You should now hear the input source you have connected. You're now ready to record.